common Subaru head gasket problems and symptoms. Before we dive in, click on the subscriber button. Like and share. We'll be back after the break. Subaru cars are great cars and people love how they handle the snow and the adverse condition. Though Subaru cars are awesome cars, we see a lot of people, who have a lot of Subaru head gasket issues, that is why we thought of sharing with you some of the common problems that you can find with Subaru cars. The primary function of the head gasket is a solidifying ratio of walls around the cylinder head, and engine block that ensures that the engine oil or the coolant stays within the cylinders for the proper functioning of the car. The head gasket can effortlessly be recognized with the flat shape, tinny outline, and large holes which is where the engine blocks and cylinders are channeled through. Types of Head Gaskets Multi-Layer Steel Gaskets Head these are the most current head gaskets made of multi-layer steel. They are best for car engines with a higher level of compression, for instance diesel engine vehicles. Copper Gasket Head Copper is one of the elements used to this day in some high-performance cars and applications. Older types of head gaskets are made with copper and they help ensure the gasket head is long-lasting. Composite Head Gasket The composite head gasket is hardly seen in the market today and that is because they are made with asbestos or graphite which is highly toxic. The composite head gaskets are not as durable gadgets and they definitely not as durable as the multi-layer steel gaskets and copper gaskets. Symptoms of Subaru Head Gasket Issues First, you will find or notice oil dropping down between the head and the engine block surface. These leak gets even heavier with time and probably will result in a coolant leaking issue as well. Option 2 is that you might perceive a sulfur or fuel smell from the coolant tank or reservoir. And you will also notice at this point, a high reading in the temperature gauge of the coolant. And finally, there definitely will be frequent and regularly overheating of the car engine while on a long distance drive. Overheating, if a head gasket is cracked or malfunctioning, coolant can leak. Without the proper level of coolant, the engine will quickly overheat. If an engine overheats as a result of another problem, such as a radiator leak, it can warp the heads, causing the gasket to malfunction, crack or leak. White smoke White smoke coming from the exhaust is a sign that the head gasket is not functioning properly. This indicates that coolant is entering the cylinder, and the heat from the piston firing is creating steam, which exits through the exhaust. Beige colored oil, the head gasket creates a barrier that allows oil to move above the gasket and coolant to flow below. When the gasket is cracked or has a hole in it, the oil can mix with the coolant. The oil in the system will turn to a light brown, viscous substance. How to Prevent Head Gasket Failure Subaru Change the car oil regularly. See recommended here on Amazon. Try to clean the surroundings of the car battery plus the terminals on a regular basis to accumulate dust leading to corrosion or rust. Checking the coolant cylinder and changing the fluid when it's dirty. You should have your Subaru car maintenance service done by a reputed car shop or an experienced mechanic, dedicated to Subaru car models. Subaru Head Gasket Replacement Step 1 Remove the intake system and all hoses and wires to get to the cylinder heads. Be careful while removing the car engine intake system and other not damages anything doing this. When you have successfully removed the intake manifold, hoses, wires, and fuel lines, you should now see the cylinder heads. Step 2 now you want to take the cylinder heads. And to heads properly take out the cylinder, make sure you refer to the car shop manual for your particular car engine model or type. Various engines require different processes. To preserve your Subaru car cylinder heads, bolts, plus other vital components, 
Be sure to follow the instructions provided in the manual. After you have removed the cylinder heads then you will now see the damaged Subaru head gaskets and the state of the gaskets, cylinders, and engine block. This will get give you an idea of how much damage has occurred. Step 3 You have to now replace the head gasket with a new one which not expensive, you can make your choice here on Amazon. I hope this video was helpful, please don't forget to click on the subscriber button, like, and share for more videos.